Okay, everybody, this is how you need to wrap up your work to bring to school. As you can see here, I have my projects. And I also have a Ziploc bag that says my name and the class period. You definitely need this. You're also going to need either some paper towel, uh, tissues, napkins, uh, newspaper would work, anything that you can kind of pack these with. So we're going to just wrap each one up uh, gently. Now, your project wouldn't be fired yet, so it would be even more fragile than this. So we need to be careful, okay? So I'm going to just kind of gently put this around the object, being extremely gentle. You see I kind of like fold the paper towel on top. Okay, now I have a puffy side on this side and it's flat on that one, so I'm going to do the other side too. There's a puff on that one, so I'm going to just put this to the side for a second. I'm going to do the other side of this one. See? I'm going to do a puff on that side. So I got two pieces of paper towel on each, and I might put one in the bag just to have it there like this. I'm going to open up the Ziploc. I'd probably put the projects down while you open the Ziploc. I'm going to place them in here. If you want to try and like maybe leave extra air in here so it's a little puffy, what you can do is close it most of the way, blow on the edge, and you can inflate the bag if you like. That'll keep it even more safe. All right? So making sure that you have your name on there, on your Ziploc, the projects are safe. If you don't want to puff up the bag, you don't have to because then they won't clank around as much. In fact, if you want to do that, you can just release the air. Gently push around them. Now your projects are very fragile, so don't push on the project itself. Then you would close the Ziploc bag back up, and then they would kind of stay more still. All right? So, again, wrap your work up gently, making sure it's kind of puffy. They're sitting in their own little clouds. Name, class period, and you need to go on Google Classroom on your main page. Click on the link for signing up for a time slot to drop this off. I'll be waiting near that table pretty much the whole day tomorrow and on Wednesday. If you have any questions, email me and let me know.